Hey boo, welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel. If you're new today, I'm going to be doing a get ready with me hair, makeup, and outfit. Going out for some drinks or whatever. So yeah, I decided to get glammed and I wanted to film it. Everything that's in this video will be in the description box below if you're interested. If you want to see how I achieve this look, then just keep watching. All right, I'm going to be starting off with my makeup. I'm starting off with this primer. Oh, I'm so excited to be going out tonight like it feel like it kind of feel like i haven't been out in a long time but it ain't been that long oh yeah i already started with my brows and my lashes on uh, for my brows i use anastasia dip brow pomade in the color ebony and then for my lashes they're from amazon i'll link them down below in the description if you're interested in them today i'm going to be using i'm going to be mixing two of my foundations i'm going to be using i don't even know if this is a good idea but we're gonna do it they're two different foundations. We're going to see how they do. But I just feel like this will make like the perfect shade for me. I don't know. We're going to see. So I'm going to be using the Estee Lauder Double Wear um, Foundation in the color. So I'm going to be using the Estee Lauder Double Wear Foundation in the color Hazel. And I'm also going to be using the Too Faced Born This Way Foundation in Chestnut. So I'm going to mix these two and apply those bad boys. So I'm gonna take more of the Estee Lauder and just like one pump of this one. So let's see, I'm gonna do one pump, one and a half pumps of the Estee Lauder and then one full pump of the Too Faced. Ooh, 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 Dang. I should've put less of the Too Faced one. Yeah, yeah, we're just in a mood to go out and here we are, you know, just get cute, go out type of shit. So that's what we're doing. Take this beauty sponge right here and I'm going to just blend it because I feel like I put a quite bit of foundation. So I'm going to just blend some. Next, I'm going to go in with some concealers. I'm going to use my e.l.f. concealers in the color 10 Neutral and Medium Warm. I'm going to go in with 10 Neutral first and then I'm going to go in with Medium Warm second. I'm also thinking about bringing the, I mean, taking out my bangs because I got bangs on this wig. And I think I'm going to do that when I do this hair. I'm going to let that dry for a little bit. Um, not too long because we know this concealer dry fast as fuck. So we're going to let that dry for a little bit. I'm going to put some of the tan neutral. I'm going to put some of this tan neutral shade down my nose. Above my lid. And mm, I don't know about the chin. I don't know if we feel in the chin or not. I'm going to leave the chin alone. We'll see about it. Now I'm going to blend this out. I'm going to start off with my chin. This is my Morphe. My Morphe M173 brush. And my the foundation brush that I used was the e.l.f. Buffering. Bu buffing. Bu mm. The brush that I used for my foundation was the e.l.f. Buffing foundation brush. Ooh, that was a tongue twister. I'm going to blend this out. It's just like that. I should have started blending the other side first. I just realized because I put that side first. Blend this side out. I like to stay in the same area too when I'm blending. At first to kind of keep that coverage there. And then I start making my way outwards. I'm going to take my e.l.f. sponge and just blend it out. I'm just using it to go over it just to blend everything out. Next, I'm going to use a Maybelline Fit Me Powder in the color Light Medium. I'm going to use that for under my eyes. I like this powder, though. I do. Yeah. Next, I'm going to, since I'm going out, I don't know how the night's going to be or whatever. So, I didn't have to say it like that. Okay, so I'm going to take some of my e.l.f. HD powder. I'm going to set my whole face with this. This is some translucent powder. I'm going to set it because this really do keep your shit in place, okay? So I'm going to set it with this. I'm going to look a little, a little powdery at first, but trust the process. And my brows, too. A little, like, slightly above my lids, too. Because I kind of like when my lids get a little, a little oily <laughs> sometimes. I mean, I don't know why, but... It be looking cute sometimes. But you can't tell that it's oil. It just be looking like you got a glossy lid. Well, you do got a glossy lid, right? But it be looking cute to me, so. 
I don't want to put too much, you know, especially I ain't got no eyeshadow anyway. And then I'm going to, uh, if you got a dry face, if you got dry skin, you could skip that powder setting thing because baby, it might be too much for you. Okay. Oh, <laughs> this damn thing. So I'm going to take my fit me, um, I'm going to take my Maybelline fit me press powder in the shade 235 pure beige i feel like it's too light for me like i do feel like this shade could be too light for me mm. i'm gonna take this and set go over that how many more minutes was i left because y'all i'm literally timing myself because a bitch could okay i got eight minutes left like stop playing with me Okay, so after that's all set, now I'm going to go in with some bronzer. Real quickly, lickety, dickety, wickety, wickety. <laughs> I don't know what that was, okay? Um, with some contour. This is actually bronzer, not even contour. This is the NYX Matte Bronzer in the color... Medium. Damn, a bitch feel like she glammed up. Uh, yeah, I feel like I'm way too fucking glam. Like, am I doing too much? For real. Like, am I doing too much? Because, baby, it, it, I know I saw what's going on, but, like, I feel like I'm getting, <laughs> baby. Shit. I'm feeling it, though. I'm gonna go in with some nose contour, like a slight nose contour. I don't really do too much. I'm taking that bronzer that I just used, and this is a brush by e.l.f. I think it's their blending brush. If I'm a... If I'm not mistaken, but it looked like this in case you want to know. Oh, OG YouTube. Okay. And I'm going to put on some blush. I'm trying to see if I want to do this blush. This is Milani Palia. This is a Milani 02 Floral Fantasy uh, blush. I need to buy me some new blushes. I've been using this blush forever. I have this one or that elf one. But I kind of want to get like an orange blush, you know? I feel like that'll look really cute. But I use a first shade, the lightest shade in here. I put some on my nose too, to kind of give me like a romantic looking look. Mm -hmm. Yes, it does, baby. Yes, but I also gotta be careful because I got this bright ass light. <laughs> Relax, okay? And so next I'm gonna set my face with this. How many minutes we at? How many minutes we at? Okay, we good, we good, we good. Okay, we're going to let that do what it do. My flat irons are getting hot right now. I'm going to put on my lip color like after the fact. But now I need to I need to put on highlighter. I need to put on highlighter and then some under eye. Don't want to make the eyes dark. I don't know. Oh. Oh, my cooter. Okay. Let me text my cousin that I'm finishing up my hair. Because technically I am finishing it. Because it's already installed, baby. Right? <laughs> Some highlighter, the e.l.f. highlighter and rose gold. My usual, 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 usual. Put that down the nose. We're going to start with the inner eye, though. I need a brow gel. Actually, I do have one in there. I do. I'm going to put some of this highlighter just under my brows a little bit. I'm going to take this brush right here. It's an M213 by Morphe. And I'm going to take my Too Faced palette and a dark shade in here, like a dark brown, which is Charmed. I'm not sure. I'm going to take this color right here, Charmed. I'm not sure. Hold on. I want y'all to be able to see it. Can I see it? It's kind of not picking up. There we go. Oh, I'm sure. <laughs> It's called Charmed, I'm sure. Okay, cool. So I'm gonna take some of this and I'm gonna just darker my lower lid. I'm gonna use this shit to do it. I'm gonna apply it really close to like my waterline. Just bought this brush. Oh my gosh, do y'all see the difference? Where's my light too fucking bright? Oh baby, yes! Okay, now we need some eyeliner, some black eyeliner. So right here, I'm gonna use this Kiss Luxury Intense Eyeliner. Shout out 
Should I do Lower Lash Mascara 2 or would that be too damn dark, huh? I don't know. It might work. That shit might work, for real. Guess what? We'll never know. If we don't try. I got a piece of mascara on my... Okay, it could look like a beauty mark. We're going to just leave it alone. I'm about to start on the hair. I don't know where this wig is from, but I'm sure I did this wig on my channel, one video. Like when I wore this blonde wig. So I'm just brushing it out right now. I have some curls up in here from earlier. Damn, okay. Don't make me look bad. <laughs> Take off this scarf first because it's kind of making it hard for me to brush. But I'm going to just do some... I don't, I'm not going to fix my lace and shit. So, I'm going to do some... I don't feel like fixing my lace. So, I ain't even going to hold you, okay? Do some bangs. We're going to bring out the bangs. I already have bangs on here. So, I'm not making any new ones. I already cut previous bangs. Yeah, see? We don't want to do this and do all of that. Bring them out. Bring them out. I'm going to just flat iron it for now. Just to, like, make it come this way. <laughs> all right, that's out the way. We're going to just leave it like that for now, okay? And then I'm gonna start on the curl. Actually, I'm just worrying about the bottom, to be honest. And I'm curling it upwards and I'm using my flat irons. I don't like that one. Let's try this one. That's much better. Yeah, this is a part of my hair that got wet. Ugh. So I don't even know how this is gonna curl. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. The curls gonna do what they they gonna drop um and whatnot. So Gonna look cute and they're gonna separate by themselves like i just separated that one but they're gonna separate by themselves and they're just gonna look cute this side i could have did a better job on i ain't even gonna lie at least this one that's my problem put on my dress and my heels and whatnot and i also fixed my little bangs i just went over with the pressing comb and then just recurled them with the uh just recurled them with the flat irons but now i'm about to do my lip combo i'm gonna put, start off with the nyx lip liner and espresso and moisturize your lips before you do this. I'm gonna take Madeline and put that on here. Going with some fortune cookie too. By NYX, the lip gloss. I mean the butter gloss. And I just put this on here to brighten it up a little bit more. And then once we're like that, you just wanna put some clear gloss on here to top it off. And there we have it, okay? Okay, so this is the outfit, but dress from Forever 21, and then my heels are from Forever 21 too. And then I'm gonna wear, then I'm gonna wear this purse with it. But at the same time, I feel like this purse kind of taken away. I feel like this purse could be taken away from it in a way. I'm trying to see. I don't, I don't think, I don't think I'm gonna actually wear the. Uh, the purse and stuff like i'm just i don't know i think i'm gonna just do no purse yeah that's pretty much it for this video let me turn this down so but yeah that's pretty much it for this video i i just <laughs> that's pretty much it for this video i hope you enjoyed getting ready with me if you did make sure you give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel okay but yeah i'll see you in my next video bye boo